What's going on guys, this is the One Round Right Going. Today we are here with a box of Dual Overload, the set that just released on my birthday. March 19th was my birthday, I'm recording this March 20th, so if you want to tell me happy birthday down in the comments, I'd be much appreciated. But yes, my wonderful girlfriend got me a box of this a day early actually, she bought it on Wednesday, so she actually got it a day before the actual release date. Don't ask me how she did that, she's magical like that. But yeah, I'm here with it. And of course, it's been like three weeks since I've uploaded a video, given everything that's been going on, my own personal life issues, uh, getting in a rear end accident, so on and so forth. Spring break turning into a coronavirus pandemic quarantine land and school moving online, everything. It's been really crazy these past weeks. And so I'm sorry I haven't been able to upload properly that um, among trying to balance school work and all the other nonsense that's been going on this year because the world's li literally been on fire or at war with themselves whatever this entire year but i'm here with this and i have at least another video coming behind this as well so we should still have some uploads coming i'm thinking about doing an up uh update video sometime soon as well just to talk about some stuff see where i want to move the channel towards because if i'm not able to constant uh, consistently buy cards and stuff given everything that's going on i might want to move to different content just for a little while see if i like it or whatever. probably like doing video games or whatever because what i do with my friends anyway especially on the mineral gamers check them out anyway let's get into this i don't have a knife on me at the moment i don't know where my little one went so i got scissors but always carry a knife but always practice knife safety you don't want to harm yourself or others Especially in the pandemic of the coronavirus, you, staying out of the hospital is your best bet. So, uh, yeah. As for this set, there's a whole lot of good stuff. I'll give you a look at the back. So many Link monsters, it's overloading the system. 30 brand new Link monsters. Contains 6 all-foil ultra-rare dual overload packs, each with 5 cards as well as 1 to 6 oversized manga-inspired classic monster cards. So we got a whole bunch of stuff. We're looking for like uh, needle fiber or house tricks or whatever it's pronounced. Howl tricks. I know the Q's silent in that. But needle fiber. There's uh, phantasmes. A whole bunch of fun stuff in here that we need. And we have the uh, oversized card, which is kind of stuck in here. I got to get it out. There we go. Is it Blue Eyes White Dragon? I hope it is. Oh, Silver Dragon Infinity. Not bad. That's cool. I'll take it. Uh, stick that back in here. I like the whole manga style of it too. That's pretty cool. That's... I just wish they would take the Pokemon route <clears throat> and make these oversized cards hollow. That would be cool. But no, they don't want to do that. Alrighty, so take the packs out. One, two, three, four, five, six. So we got, see, we got Needle Fiber. We got Phantasme. Uh, the new, uh... Five-headed Dragon Link monster. This the Cyber Dragon Infinity alternate art. So I'm actually gonna open it in this order. Uh, there, there. I'll open this lame card first. Sky Strikers are lame, but they're still alive, so that's cool. We got Giga Plant. Nice. Uh, we got Ferocious Flame Swordsman. So we got the Flame Swordsman Link monster. That's pretty neat. Hey, right, Pretty Plant and Verde uh, uh, Anaconda. This is actually a really good one. Lots of nonsense to be done with this card. Very good with fusion stuff. I might actually use this in my Thunder Dragons, even though they're not really a deck anymore, yet they are, whatever. I'm good to have pulled this, though. Um, uh, a Malefic Paradox Gear. So we got the Malefic Support. And Ojama Emperor. I might have to toss that to Emerald Gamer. That's definitely a card that he's been wanting, and I think he got packs. I know he said he was going to go get some, but I don't know if he actually did and what he got. So, uh, oh, we got Y Strix. That's a good one, too. Good new Link Monster. Speedroid Marble Machine. Mecha Phantom Beast. Uh, Arrow. Oro Rudon. I don't know. He's on the back of the car. He's on the back of the box. Vanity Ruler. Synchro Tencent. Nice. Okay, so we got two good Link Monsters so far. Maybe I'll have to rebuild Black Wings to make use of the Rage Monster Link. Uh, we have Giga Plant, Ferocious Flame Swordsman, uh, Lib the World Key Blade Master, so continuing the World Legacy storyline. So I think she's alive again, I think. Um, what? Angurkum Umbrella. Okay. Double Evolution Pill. That's also a nice one. So come on, we need 
Thanos dragon. We need needle fiber. We need all that good stuff. We got deck lockdown. Uh, Malefic territory. Is that a field spell? No, it's continuous. Witchcrafter creation. Malefic tune. And protector whelp of destruction swordsman. So we got the uh, blade, uh, buster blader link. Still don't have a blue eyes link, which makes no sense to me because, you know, one of the most over-supported decks of all time. But, you know, whatever. Deck lockdown again. Territory. Eh, ha. Christron Halfibrax. That's what it is. Halfibrax. Easy peasy. It's beautiful. So let's read the busted card that people were afraid of it, us getting. Two link monsters, including a tuner. Or two monsters, including a tuner. If this card is link summoned, you can special summon one level three or lower tuner from your deck or your hand or deck in defense position, but it cannot activate its effects this turn. During your opponent's main phase or battle phase, quick effect, you can banish this card you control. Summon one tuner synchro monster from your extra deck. This is treated as a synchro summon. You can only use each effect of Christron Halfibrax once per turn. So there's a whole lot of nonsense that can be done with this. A whole lot of uh, nasty plays to do on your opponent's turn. And we'll see where this goes, given that all the big Yu-Gi-Oh! tournaments and events are canceled at the moment because of the virus we don't know but hey dueling network's still a thing hey we got the smorg uh, bird of so uh so sovereignty i think it is and i might have to share this with emerald gamer because this one's actually kind of good as well this one's pretty good too can't be used as link material it's link three your opponent cannot target this card or a winged beast monster you control with card effects or this card points to a card effects my bad has all three down arrows too very good if this card would be destroyed by battle, you can destroy one other smorg card you control instead. During the end phase, you can start summon one winged beast monster from your hand or deck with a level equal to or lower than the total number of unused spell and trap zones on the field. You can only use this effect once per turn. So it's a hard once per turn effect for that, because it's the name of the card itself. But this is not bad. There are shenanigans to be done with this. And Bloom Harvest is the Melodious Composer. Pretty. So... We got one pack left. Can we pull a Thanos Dragon? And it, I, honestly, I kind of want an Imperm more because I've been sitting at two Impermanences forever. And despite I'll have two Secrets, one Ultra, I'll be okay with that. As long as I just get two. Okay, we got a second Raid Raptor Link. Nice. Uh, Marble Machine again. Starving Venom Lethal Dose Dragon. That's a that's a name. Card of Fate. And Scrap Ortho, uh, Orthoros. Orthoros. <laughs> anyway, this opening has been amazing. Actually, this actually went really well. We have two raider. We got, we got needle fiber. That's really all that matters. And I'm keeping this for myself. Put them in a nice little sleeve here. Beautiful. One box, one pull. All we need. But that's been pretty good. If you guys can find this, I know a lot of uh, it's kind of tough now because a lot of places are closed. But uh. I feel like toilet paper is going to be more sold out than this set is. You might find it at your local retailers. And also, if your game, your locals are still open, like mine is, but it's not really open for play. It's more so for just the retail side of things. And they got a limited amount of this set as well. So the sooner you can get to this set, the better. If you didn't already order a case like a lot of people did. I'd say I'd get on this set. This set has a lot of good stuff. The pull racers might be eh. I know there's buyouts happening right now as well. So ordering them online might be tough. As well, at least for a good price, that is. I don't want to pay price gouging prices because people are trying to, you know, rip people off. But, you know, I pulled all I needed. I don't know, there's some more stuff I need. But, you know, I pulled the big thing, so we're good. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like down below. Subscribe for more content like this, Yu-Gi-Oh! and Pokemon alike. And I have been the one, Rylan Ryko. I'll see you guys next time.